So, guys, about last night, uh, pretty big meeting, huh? You should have been there. Your dad got really into it. Yeah, well, I heard Donna was really, uh... Vocal? Yeah, and she was pretty, um... Persuasive? Yes, yes. Really persuasive. Yeah, I think after she finished talking, a lot of people have changed their minds. Well, yeah, definitely. So, do you think I should, uh, you know... Make a move? I have to admit, it has crossed my mind. Well, here's a shocker. I bet it's crossed hers, too. Yeah. So you think this condom availability plan is going to go through, huh? Well, Andrea thinks it's a shoe-in, but I don't know. It only passed the parents' meeting by a couple of votes. But how soon do you think before we get some? Go to a drugstore, man. Excuse me, All I've been hearing about for days is Andrea Zuckerman and her mighty condom crusade. It smells fine to me. What do you think? Me too. I mean, this whole condom thing is already such old news. Uh, I'll just have tea. My stomach is really on the fritz. Well, believe it or not, some people haven't gotten the message yet. You were telling me all about birth control before I ever even got my period. <coughs> well, with a wild child like you, I figured we were better safe than sorry. But how many kids your age are emotionally ready to be involved in a sexual relationship? It's so much easier with a boy. And just give him a copy of Playboy and say, good luck. Dad. <laughs> I'm just kidding. They know I was kidding. But the point is, it's not just about birth control anymore. It's really about disease prevention. I mean, it's a completely different world than when we were young. Yeah. In our day, we had to walk 10 miles through the snow just to get to a love-in. <laughs> well, I may be out of step with most of my friends, but as much as I agree condoms are necessary, I don't think they're necessary in school. I mean, like you said, a lot of kids just aren't ready to deal with sex. Most of the boys are totally obsessed with it as it is. Next thing you know, they're going to be throwing condom balloons out the second floor lounge. Oh, come on. They're not that bad. Yes, they are. David, tell them. Tell them what? These days, isn't just everyone totally preoccupied with sex? Uh, not that I've noticed. So I'm kind of nervous, you know, and I see him sitting behind the counter. But the cashier's being really obnoxious, and she's yelling out the prices at the top of her lungs. Come on, get to the point. Did you get any or no? <clears throat> Check it out. <sighs> Do you ever know there were so many varieties? What'd you get, one of each? 